Today in this video I'm going to show you your PC does not meet the minimum hardware. Requirements for Windows 11 error, what is it, and how to fix it. While installing Windows 11, a lot of users are facing this PC can't run Windows 11. Error. The error occurs due to two factors, secure boot and TPM settings. The error might occur due to two reasons. Firstly, the secure boot feature in the BIOS. Setting might be disabled, leading to the error. Secondly, the TPM 2.0 shall be disabled, which is one of the Windows 11 minimum hardware requirement. Both these errors might occur when a user is trying to run the Windows 11. However, there is a possible fix. For both the errors, follow the steps to fix this PC doesn't meet the minimum system. Requirements for Windows 11 error. First exit Windows setup then the computer will restart to go to the boot menu into the BIOS settings by hitting the delete key or F2 or whatever button your PC shows for this. When you restart it. Now, go to peripherals, that is what it is on our PC, and double click on Intel platform. Trust technology, PTT. You can see it is disabled right now. Click enabled in the pop-up. Now, it will show the PTT is enabled too. Meaning, TPM 2.0 is now available to your PC. After enabled the TPM settings then go to BIOS menu bar and BIOS, turn off CSM first. Here's how, find CSM under BIOS or security or whatever menu, and double click on it. Click disabled, now, you will see that CSM has turned off. You will also see the secure boot option. But wait, you can't enable it just yet. So, save. And exit and enter the BIOS again. Press F10 key on your keyboard and save your BIOS settings. Click yes to save the settings and reboot the system. Be sure to press the required key. Again to reboot into BIOS settings again. Now, go to BIOS settings again and out double click secure boot. Select to enabled. The BIOS screen will now show the secure boot is enabled. Press F10 key on your keyboard and save your BIOS settings. Click yes to save the settings and reboot the system. When the computer restarts then press F12 to go to the boot menu other motherboard boot. Menus are different such as F2, F10. After coming to the boot menu, select the bootable pen drive and hit enter. Now install it the way you wanted to install Windows 11. You will see that there will be no error problem. After enabling these two things, there will be no problem or error when installing Windows 11. Congratulations you have done it. If you have difficulty understanding something, please comment in the comment box. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel.